Dear friends, a very warm welcome to the Global Stat Academy Statistics for Data Science. Hope you guys are really enjoying this COVID period and learning a lot of stats and doing a lot of coding pace. So today, what I'm going to discuss is about a very important topic named as information value. So what exactly is information value is? So it is a data exploration technique which helps to determine which metrics in a data set have more predictive power or can influence on the value of a specified dependent variable. So IV, in short, is based on an analysis of each individual or independent variable in turn without considering other predictor variable. So generally, weight of evidence help to transform a continuous independent variable into a set of groups or bins and based on the similarity of dependent variable distributions, that is number of events and non-events. The transform variable can be a continuous variable with weight of evidence value, though it is same as any kind of continuous variable. So the basic concept is information value measures the correlation of a specific variable with other variables. It is useful for ranking large number of variables based on their explanatory power for a specific variable. It captures linear as well as nonlinear relationship. Higher the IV, better is the explanatory power. <clears throat> so why we are saying this? higher the IV, the better. Because weight of evidence and information value are pretty simple, yet powerful techniques to perform variable transformation and selection. These concepts have huge connection with the logistic regression modeling technique. It is widely used in credit scoring to measure the separation of the good customer versus the bad customer. Right? So in industry standard, the IV should be greater than 0 0.5, which implies that particular matrix is having a very good explanatory power. So, in general, when a company, say for example, a computer giant, is sending you a response mailer to a campaign, because while we are building model, we are going to build the model on the historical data. So we have seen in the past that when a computer giant is sending a response campaign mailer to a particular customers, that particular customers will definitely look into those page of the computer website that what is the product he need to buy. Say for example, laptops, desktops, servers, printers, etc. Rather, if he has any kind of personal interest in boating and selling, that is going to be definitely having a very low information value compared to the number of the page views, number of the visit durations in that particular page, number of product views for that particular company. So th these are the main kind of reasons that what we used information value Try doing any kind of modeling exercise. Watch out for this in our next class. You can contact us at globalstat.in or at YouTube, LinkedIn, Facebook, and Telegram. Thank you.